I'm Giselle Cavilla from San Francisco, and I actually wanted to share with you some of my skin secrets. So the biggest word on the street really is all about mineralized, right? So what is it all about, kind of what it does to your skin? So I'm gonna take you by a step-by-step -step that I usually do use myself, and that kind of keeps my skin with that luxurious, glowing kind of feel that still gives me that natural skin quality and makes me look like I have nothing on. So I'm gonna start. This is actually the new foundation. Just basically what I wanna do is unlock it, and all you wanna do is pretty much press one pump. So that's pretty much the amount that you want on your skin. Right now I'm going to go ahead and mix a little bit of this foundation with a drop of this. It's called the Prep and Prime Fortified Skin Enhancer and the color of it is kind of like a peach tone. So what it'll do is it will kind of warm up your skin. It also helps to moisturize. I'm going to go ahead and just mix it and warm it up with my fingers. And I'm going to go ahead and start right in the center of my face. A little bit on the chin underneath the nose. And as I'm kind of putting it on, it, as you can already see it, it looks really, really natural. If you notice, I put very, very little, if not nothing, on my forehead, just because I don't want it to look too heavy. I'm gonna use my 187 brush. This is one of my favorite brushes. It's like the magic wand. It kind of really helps to buff everything right on really, really smoothly. The texture that you're gonna get, and that's the payoff you're gonna get, it'll diminish kind of like the, the finer lines under the eyes. If you notice, like the pores as well are kind of more, I would say, even toned, and it really kind of gives you that mannequin-like skin quality without it looking like overly makeup-y or overly done. So now that I kind of went ahead and buffed that right out, I'm gonna show you my next step. This is the other big secret. So like any picture, um, usually when you have a beautiful frame around it, it kind of enhances the picture a bit more. So that's kind of like how I like to think about when I contour my face. I'm using the brush 116, and this is called the Mineralize Skin Finish, and it's in dark. This is kind of like my go-to product when I maybe don't want to wear any makeup or any foundation. And I'm gonna go ahead and start on the outer part of kind of my cheekbone to my ear. So I'm gonna go ahead, start on the outer part. I wanna do a soft pout just to kind of really help get that shape into your cheekbones. Now, here's other big secret. If you kind of contour this area right here, it kind of just almost pulls everything back. Same thing with your cheekbones. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of depth there. So using the same product, I'm gonna go ahead and use my brush 217. It has also the perfect shape to create that crease. And I kind of wanna just add it almost work as a windshield wiper from back and forth, left to right, and just kind of pull it out. We're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna use the same mineralized um, concealer. This is probably my other absolute favorite products because it just kind of, again, helps diminish any kind of like fine line. It just kind of smooths everything over. I think especially underneath the eyes, everybody wants to look very fresh. I think the, the biggest thing about the mineralized uh, products, all of them really being, is that they really have over 77 minerals in it, so which really kind of helps to keep your skin balanced and hydrated. And sometimes it's the thing that we you know, might forget to do. I just kind of put it more in the center of my face. I'm gonna grab this brush, it's called the 224. And I'm just going to kind of smooth this all the way again. And the biggest thing is, I call that, that's like my eight hours of sleep in a tube. I'm just gonna highlight my face with this product. It's called the Cream Color Base and it's called Hush. And I'm gonna put it right on the center of my face. And this is gonna also kind of enhance and kind of highlight what I already did. Because before I contoured my face, which added a bit of that depth on the cheekbones and the nose and the eyes, now I'm gonna add a little bit of light. So again, it's gonna go right on the cupid's bow. You can kind of just softly do it with your fingers. I'm gonna blend it away with a brush in a second. I'm gonna do it right in there. Right, sometimes even up above the brow kind of gives it that nice little lift right about there. Same thing on the other side. One more. Now again, just doing this almost kind of raises the depth of your cheekbone. So you kind of have those really ultra glamorous ones. Now I'm gonna take this little brush here. This is called, this is kind of like the little sister to the 187. Um, I'm gonna just go ahead and blend that away again. You can kind of blend anything away really, any kind of hard line that I might have not taken care of with that. I love lipstick and the reason why is because I think it gives you something powerful to say. So 
This is actually one of my new favorite products as well. It's called um, the Mineralized Lipstick. It's kind of like a berry tone, and it's really beautiful because it, it has that really kind of silky feel to your lips. It's really hydrating. I'm gonna go ahead and put that on. So the lipstick is actually, not only is it a new formula, but if, if you notice, it's actually kind of bigger. And the nice part about it is that it kind of really gets a really nice, even kind of grip around your lips. Now, the nice part about that is you can already see a natural shine too. So I think a lot of women sometimes don't love the gloss story. This is kind of like a good way to get that hydrating lip quality and also kind of have that, that kind of texture that you might want when, that a gloss can also create. But it still has a really nice color payoff. I'm gonna actually mix it and the reason why is because I just kind of want a darker kind of berry lip and I'm all about mixing sometimes. I think sometimes mixing a, a color kind of makes it a little bit more of your own. With this whole mineralized collection, I've kind of really achieved a really balanced look that I can wear every single day.